All right, well, hopefully you came up with these answers here. You had your first five partial sums, and then if you wrote them in a list, this is what you should have gotten. All right, so I'm going to refer to these. I'm going to refer to these in the next slide. So I want to talk about an idea, or two ideas. And they, those are convergence and divergence. So the definition of convergence is, it is a series converges, if the sequence of partial sums has a limit as n goes to infinity. And a definition of divergence is just a series that doesn't converge. And so now we ask, which of the series above appear to converge? So take again another look at the examples we did, A, B, and C. A, remember, A, remember, our, our sequence of partial sums was uh, 0 0.1, and then it was 0 0.11, and then it was 0 0.111, right? Now, is this list approaching anything, do you think? If you think about it for a minute, it seems like in the long run, this is just going to become, this is just going to go to, point one with an infinite number of ones which is just point one com repeating so I think we would say that this looks like it's gonna converge to point one repeating which by the way for those of you who know is also known as a ninth right so by the definition right that this the once we did the partial sums and wrote them out as a list if that list looks like it's approaching something then we would say it converges Compare that to B and C, right? For B, we had our, our list of partial sums was uh, 10, 30, 60, 100, 150, and then it was just going to keep going, right? For B, is that list approaching anything? I mean, it's approaching infinity, which is not a number, so we would say it diverges. And C... If we look at it, we have the numbers, uh, it starts with a 1, it starts with a 1, and then it's a 0, and then it's a 1, and then it's a 0, and then it's a 1. Does it look like that's approaching anything? In uh, Does it look like that list is approaching a particular number? And that's where this word comes in, um, it has a limit. Meaning, is there one number that it looks like this list is approaching? No, it looks like it's approaching two, right? Half the time it's one, half the time it's zero. So, since that's not one unique number, we'd say this diverges. Diverges. Okay, so two examples of divergent sequence and one of a convergent sequence. A series, I'm sorry, series. And notice the, the clever definition of divergence is just simply, it's just a series that doesn't converge. It's a series that does not look like the sum, the partial sums are approaching anything. Okay? So, most of the time we're going to limit our discussion to geometric, uh, geometric series, which we'll do in the next, uh, the next video.